And happening right now in Jacksonville Beach, demonstrators gathered at the Seawalk Pavilion for what they call a display of unity. News 4 Jacks reporter Brittany Muller is joining us live with a message that this group hopes to send. Brittany. Mary Kent, Beaches for Change, says it's all about bringing the support here to Jacksonville Beach peacefully. And as you can see, hundreds out here at the Seawalk Pavilion on Jacksonville Beach with signs showing their support. Beaches for Change was created by an Atlantic Beach woman on social media. Organizers tell me they have been concerned that the beaches are predominantly white and haven't been participating in the protests. And that's why they say they are meeting here tonight. While organizers say they are not sure just how many people will, will participate tonight, they are expecting to sit in a circle, let speakers talk, and let their voices be heard, chanting and showing symbolic symbols. This is what organizers told me. We just uh, we want to show that we care out, out here too. Um, I didn't see anything going on, so I initiated this movement um, to, to you know to show our support out here. We're a predominantly white community here in the beaches, and it's really easy for us not to care about what's going on downtown or really what happens in our own police system um, throughout the city of Jacksonville and even into St. Augustine. And so I think that by us planning, we're not here to speak, especially considering that we're white. We just want to use our skills that we have planning and organizing to amplify other black voices and people of color throughout the community. And under live lookout here, hundreds gathered, sitting here, holding their signs at the Seawalk Pavilion. Beaches for Change says they stand with the Black Lives Matter movement in unity. Demonstrators peacefully participating while some in masks sitting here at the Seawalk Pavilion. And we will bring you this story as it's just starting here on Jacksonville Beach tonight. Reporting live from the Seawalk Pavilion, Brittany Muller, Channel 4, the local station.